Those behind the project remain optimistic. Yeah, the optimistic it will not only be ready for the convention but in July, but just like the new Hilton Hotel, ready by June 1st. Through the fencing at ground level, it is tough to see the progress that is being made on Public Square. But from 39 stories up, the new shape of the iconic downtown space is coming into view, much to the delight of those behind the project. If you look down uh, on the square from one of the many office buildings around it, uh, you can see that we've seen those images for, for years now, that butterfly shape of the Key Bank Promenade. You've got uh, Mandel Foundation Overlook Hill coming into shape right behind me. Um, and it's really exciting to see, see this image we've been working towards. After a brutal winter that pushed construction to begin in spring, crews have been hard at work, taking advantage of a dry summer while staying ahead of the approaching cold. That was part of the reason for doing double shifts over the summer, to make sure that all the stuff that has to get done while the weather's good is done now, so we're not held up by a bad winter or a long winter, uh, and that we're ready to go by next June. Along those lines, many of the trees that will fill the park are going in now so they can begin to take root. The new public square will have many bells and whistles, but all that comes with a price. All totaled estimated to be about $50 million. Fundraising has brought them about $5 million short. That's why they're asking the state to help out. Our mission is to deliver the full design uh, without having to make compromises because of the tight schedule. The state funding request is, is critical uh, to allowing us to do that. Again, June 1st is that scheduled completion date. If the money doesn't come in from the state, there are cuts they can make, they prefer not to make, especially with the RNC focusing all of those new fresh eyes on Cleveland. On your side, John Kasich, News Channel 5.